Well, romance is in the air and splurging on an, exper uh, an expensive restaurant can fill your tummy, but yet empty your wallet. So what if we told you that you could have a cook an expensive romantic meal at an affordable price in your own kitchen? Joining me right now is Chef Philippe Schmidt. You have some expert tips on uh, how to do a romantic dinner for under 50 bucks, including some wine. Not only I'm a chef, uh, thank you for having me, yeah. but I, you know, we go to a special school you know, for romance in France, you know, very young. So yes, I know all about romance. See, romance, uh, all I have to do is just listen to your accent. <laughs> you're very kind. You're very kind. So, so let, you know, making this meal at home, what are we making? We're making a crab uh, pancake <gasps> with smoked salmon, caviar, uh, pickled red onions, quail eggs because aphrodisiac. Uh, See now, when I think when I hear caviar, it's already thinking, okay, whoa, 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 you're already like way up. Yeah, but the I mean, you, you, you have a, you have four different labels. You have American sturgeon, uh, you have sebruga, you have uh, ocetra and beluga. If you want to spurge yourself, you can go for beluga. And if you want to be under 50, okay. like we're doing today, you use uh, the sebruga or American sturgeon. Okay, there you go. All right, so uh, let, let's let's get cooking. So I, I just want to show you how to make the pancake. Absolutely. Uh, because uh, we're gonna go very fast. I'm okay. gonna show you the passion of. Uh, of the romance. So I had the flour. <laughs> the passion of the romance. I had the flour, the sugar, the, um, the baking powder, a little bit of salt. So you've got flour, a little sugar, a little baking. Yeah, a little bit of a vanilla extract. Huh? And when you have all the dry, you're adding slowly. Here, you want me to do this part? You you add, no, 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 it's okay. I mean, I'm, I'm sure you would <laughs> be a great assistant. <laughs> Here, I'll just hold uh, the bowl. How so, about that? <laughs> so look, I'm incorporating the, the eggs first, okay? And, uh, and we're gonna slowly add uh, buttermilk and milk. So, ah, uh, voila, now, you, now, you, now you're a wonderful sous chef. So you want to go slowly in the middle, voila. Okay, very nice. And, um, and then uh, we're gonna add the milk. You can replace butter by, uh, buttermilk by butter. Huh? And we're gonna go slowly. I'm gonna hold it, you sure? You can I got do it. it, I got it. Oh, you're wonderful. So we're Whoa, doing this mix. Is that mix too fast? No, no, at Flo Paris, this is the type of pancake we're doing uh, for breakfast. We just started uh, our, our breakfast menu. Oh, it's starting to smell like a pancake. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> starting to smell like okay, breakfast okay, okay. in here. <laughs> so uh, you can pour uh, the whole thing okay. now. Okay, we just have to incorporate the flour slowly by uh, just absorbing you know, and basically we're going to cut uh, short this uh, wonderful meat. Sure, sure, sure. Because by the magic of TV, right? By the magic of TV, I promise you, you're going to add, <gasps> you're going to get uh, this uh, consistency that you all know. But we're adding a little bit of pesto, okay? Alors, a little bit of go. pesto, basil pesto. Uh, you're mixing the whole basil pesto into that. And so this is going to make it savory for us. Voilà, voilà. A little bit of celery. There's already some salt in here, okay? It's okay, don't be nervous, I'm here. Uh, I'm uh, all this good. Is, this is the pancake that's gonna come out. Uh, it's nice and thick. Oh yeah, be, be, because I use a ring. I, I use a metallic Let's ring. Let's hold on that up one more time, Chef, if we can. So the, of course, can. of course. See, I use a metallic ring uh, on my flat top or a non-stick pan at home, and, uh, and I pour the mix uh, to a certain point, and I let it cook. When I see the bubble, I'm adding fresh crab meat. Okay. And then I flip it over, and then, uh, voila, uh, <laughs> we, we get, we get the, this beautiful uh, crab uh, pancake. Let's, I, I want to I, I put some, uh, turn yeah, it around just let me show so you. folks can... So I, I put some creme fraiche, caviar, the quail eggs, cooked is soft. The quail eggs, I cook them only uh, one minute in boiling water. Okay. okay, so now that we have that, you know, uh, it, it, it's, oh, that looks delicious too. The little salad over there, you've got with yeah, the fresh wild mushrooms, mushrooms, and, wild mushrooms and you've got the asparagus. So we've, yes. got, we've got our side dish, we've got our, our, our crab cake, uh, crab pancake, and then, you know, we have to have some music and dessert. So let's slide on over. Let's go have a seat. Yes, yes, yes. Let's go. Uh, let's I, I, I had brought some wine. Oh, you brought some I, wine? I uh, brought some wine. Uh, if that's okay. It's we'll, okay, we'll, yeah. We'll, I we'll pretend we're having a glass of wine. <laughs> and these fabulous desserts are just Alors, all from Faux Paris. I choose the one. I look at that. W w w wonderful servant oh. that you have. You have this delicious VIP. food. VIP. <laughs> Looked like you were parched. <laughs> so I brought you, you are so parched. a little Sauvignon Blanc. Oh, nice. Oh, how did you know? This, this wine is 100% Sauvignon Blanc. And very amazing. Uh, it's a uh, white fruit. A uh, little bit of the exotic, uh, firm, but uh, but elegant at the same time. Perfect. Well, Blanc, nice with desserts then. Uh, but also for the, with the, the smoked with the salmon crab. and the, the sweetness of a pancake. Bon appetit. Oh, you're so very <laughs> nice. VIP, huh? 
I know, Bravo. I know. So anyway, I brought you a selection Cheers, of... my friend, by oh, the way. Oh, you're very kind. Yeah. Santé. <laughs> Santé. This is uh, one of, some of the dessert that Danny, our pastry chef, does at Flo Paris. So I, I choose the one that technically you should be able to replicate at home. Be because apple tatin, it's just a caramelized apple that you put in a mold and a pot pastry on it. You bake it for a few minutes and then you flip it over. That's what it is, a, a tart tatin. Oh, Sounds nice. very fancy, but it's simple. You hey, can buy. Simple's always good too. You, you can, can buy, buy you the, can step the, up and the buy pastry, the pastry cooked, and you fill it up with a, with cream, pastry cream. And everybody knows Eclair. Oh. Everybody knows Eclair. I brought the That's chocolate. That's my favorite French oh. dessert of all. And it's the big splurge. Mixed fruit yeah, tart, the, uh, the depending on the season. Oh, chef, just such wonderful, wonderful ideas. And of course, we'll put the recipe up uh, on Houston yes, Life. Yes, yes, I hope uh, so. Dot I hope TV. So. And if you want more information on Chef Philippe, follow him on Twitter. I love your Twitter name, French Cowboy. Thank you. I love and it. Flo Paris is on 5757 Westheimer. Okay.